Goddess of the full moon, Tsukuyomi, ride! If that sweet grade three doesn't win this game, I don't know what will. But our formation lacks power. Wait, what? Goddess of the full moon, Tsukuyomi, loses 2,000 power unless you have the other two versions of Tsukuyomi and God Haki Chibiyoshi in the soul. A grade three, that's not so great. This isn't good. He's going for it! <laughs> Jack is launching a brutal attack on Aichi Sendo! Boosted by evil ferret, Shijimamaru attacks Gareth. Drive trigger check. Damage trigger check. <laughs> Get ready, kid, because I'm going to put on a display of ninja techniques that'll make your head spin. Hmm. Probably fine. I shouldn't be worrying like this, but I just can't help myself. I need to know what's happening. I'm back! Hey, Kamui! <laughs> How did it go? I kicked his butt! <laughs> oh, what a relief. We only need one more. Huh? And here I thought Misaki and Aichi would have finished first. Uh... Let's crank the intensity up to 11! Cause Q4 is trying to find that second point! All thanks to Kabui's crushing victory over the Ninja Crank! Misaki Tokura, Aichi Sendo! Will one of them be able to bring home the big win? Or will Lizard and Jack of the legendary Team Ninja give us a comeback for the history books? Tagitsuhime to rear guard. She's attacking your ruined shade. <laughs> I've almost got him. It's now or never. Boosted by Gemini, goddess of the full moon, Tsukuyomi attacks! Rough Seas Banshee and Ghoul Cannonball will put a stop to that. Checking Twin Drive. Oracle Think Tank, come through for me. Mm. First check. There it is, a critical trigger. I'll give both of the effects to Silent Tom. The second check. Boosted by Crescent Moon Tsukuyomi, Silent Tom takes aim. And because of Silent Tom's ability, Grade Zeros can't be used to guard his attacks. 
Taking so long. I'm freaking out over here. <laughs> uh, Calm down. Uh, uh, I sure hope they win for all our sakes. Stand and draw. Magical guru of the abyssal depths rising up from the darkness to unleash your foul powers on the tide of this battle. The master of despair. Ice prison necromancer Kokaitis, I ride! Counterblast. Returning Ripple Banshee from the drop zone to play. Dancing Cutlass retires. Master Swordsman Nightstorm joins the fray. Boosted by Romario, Ice Prison Necromancer Kokaitis attacks. Look out! The Necromancer's true power flows forth! Limit Break! There you have it, folks! Ninja Lizard has gone and activated his limit break! Mm -hmm. Twin drive check. First card. The second. Okay, <gasps> they're tied for damage. That's fine. You can do it. Wow. <sighs> I bet you still think you're gonna find a way to win. <laughs> but there's no chance of that. The stronger your soul gets, the more irresistible it becomes. I won't stop till I destroy it. Psychic Bird will guard, along with Tagitsu Hime's intercept. <laughs> Gaining a boost from Ripple Banshee, Nightstorm swings in an extra 2,000 power from his skill. <laughs> she just had to survive that last attack. Too bad. Poor Misaki. She played pretty well, even though her deck didn't work the way it's supposed to. I'd hoped you'd be stronger. Maybe next round I'll face someone who's worth my time. <laughs> Adding extra silent toms to the deck didn't work out. <sighs> We're tied with one win apiece! So it all comes down to our third game to determine the winner. We've got Team Q4 against Team Ninja! Which of these groups will be moving on? Only one way to find out, and that's by watching the action. Go for it, Aichi. My turn. Stand and draw. I ride Knight of Superior Skills, Bowman, calling player of the Holy Bow, Vivian. Bowman attacks first. Uh! Drive check. <laughs> Boosted by Criff, Vivian is coming in. Body replacement technique. Nice try, kid, but I wasn't born yesterday. When Vivian deals damage, you're able to make a superior call. I guess this kind of thing's to be expected when you're playing against a world-renowned card fighter. So he knows how Aichi's deck works. Is that it? Knowledge is power for ninjas like us. <laughs> if knowledge is power, that explains why Morikawa's so weak. Ninja fail, yo. Years of experience have made it easy for me to spot novice players like yourself. Huh? Your deck is a weapon. And judging by the way you're holding it, I'd say you're not confident with what it can do. Y you think so? Finally! How did it go? Sorry. Huh? Uh... Hey, it's gonna be fine. We're tied with them now, so we just need Aichi to win his battle. Uh... Uh... 
I stand and draw. Ninja summon. I ride stealth dragon. Cursed breath. I call turbulent edge as well as Shiji Mamoru. Edge takes flight. Nimue guards that. Cursed breath is coming for you. Elixir Sommelier will protect me. Drive trigger check. A draw trigger emerges at the perfect time. <laughs> it's lucky you decided to guard those attacks, because if either of them had gotten through, I would have been checking the top five for a copy of Mandela Lord. It wasn't luck. I'm gonna do what it takes to shut you down. I was hoping I'd be able to sneak some of my tricks by you, but that's not the case. I guess we'll have to wait and see who's got the stronger deck. Because in the end, that's what's gonna win this game. I've heard enough. Let's do this. He's right about my lack of experience with these cards. But what choice do I have? Hmm? What do you know? Here. Huh? This should go in your deck. Hmm. Oh. Incandescent Lion Blonde Ezel? Uh, uh, thanks for the card. No sweat. Corin gave this to me for a reason. Hmm. Warrior of the Divine Flame, lend me your strength to the forces of Planet Kray and all evil shall be rebuked. Incandescent Lion, I ride Blonde Ezel! Trump cards manifest before me. Chrono Dragon next stage. Vanguard the next stage. Now on sale. Special clan packs too. Bushy Road. This is the worst. It's terrible. Great. We're in this mess because of me. Uh, no! Nobody blames you for what happened out there! It's just frustrating that we don't get to watch the final game, right? Exactly. I didn't expect to see that. Blondezel's ability increases his power by 1,000 for each gold paladin in the rear guard. Calling Silver Fang Witch! Her soul blast! Battlefield Tempest Sagramore comes to my aid! Sagramore's coming at ya! Not guarding. Ah! Boosted by Silver Fang, Ezel attacks! <laughs> Twin Drive check! Ah! I should go. Yeah? I need to get back to the hotel and study my deck before the circuit begins. Aichi. I'm gonna win this tournament. I must. <laughs> hmm. Here we go with a boost from Criff. Vivian attacks. Ninja body replacement technique. <laughs> Stand and draw. You know what? I've had enough of you. Time for the Master of Shadows to signal your defeat. The Covert Demonic Dragon. 
I ride Mandalore! Calling Cursed Breath and Million Rat. Boosted by Million Rat, I attack your vanguard! Just hold it right there, Jack! Boosted by Evil Ferret, Mandalore! I'll take it. Twin Drive! Stand Trigger! Giving all effects to Cursed Breath! Checking the top five for another copy of Mandela Lord. Cursed Breath attacks once again. Slagle Sword will guard that! <clears throat> it's your turn. <sighs> this guy's sure giving Aichi a hard time out there. I wouldn't expect any less. You know, me and this ninja have a lot in common. Oi. Yeah, you're Enemy. This means war. Why did he want another copy of Mandela? Take it easy, you guys. I stand and draw. Vivian attacks with a boost from Criff. No, Dart Spider will guard. Blondezel attacks your vanguard. <laughs> we'll see how strong that attack is after I activate Mandela Lord's Persona Blast. Paying the cost and sacrificing a copy of Mandel to place a curse on your blonde Ezel. Take this, Ninja Art Painful Shadow Grasp. His power. Oh, I see. That's it. Now I understand why he wanted that other copy so bad. And white mane for good measure. Checking the twin drive, first card. A critical trigger. It won't help Ezel. Giving all effects to Sagramore! Second check. Hmm. Sagramore's coming at ya. Counter Blast! Giving him another 3,000 power! Yeah. Dark Spider will guard against that. <sighs> it's your turn. That curse was a good start. Next, I'll show you and your teammates why kids don't belong here. <sighs> okay, stand and draw. With a boost from Million Rat, Cursed Breath attacks. Vivian intercepts. <laughs> Mandela Lord, punish him! Halo Shield Mark will nullify that attack. Twin Drive check. A critical trigger. Turbulent Edge gains all the effects. Second check. Take him down, Edge. <laughs> Checking for a copy of Mandela. Sending these cards to the bottom. <laughs> Give up. Hopefully you've realized by now that you and your friends are completely outclassed at this level. <laughs> Listen, Jack. It's true that I don't have as much experience playing against world-class card fighters as you do. But I... won't quit! What a turnaround in mere moments, Ninja Jack has managed to push Aichi Sendo to five damage. Quit toying with my heart, you two. I want to see a winner. This match is tighter than a pack of bargain hunters at a shoe sale. Uh. Oh, man, this is bad. Why is Aichi taking so long out there? We won't know till it's over. <sighs> Aichi, you've got to win. I stand and draw. 
I'm not gonna lose. My path to victory is sitting right in front of me. I'll have to trust the gold paladins to get me there. Using limit break. Not that. You've given me the damage I needed to activate it. Ugh. Stand together, my golden warriors. Paladins, help me break through. With Ezel's skill, I reveal the top card. And if it's a gold paladin, I call it to the rear guard. Knight of Elegant Skills, Gareth. Gareth's power is added to my vanguard for this turn. Griff retires. Calling Knight of Superior Skills, Bowman, and Little Babbler, Tron, to rear guard. Let's not forget that Ezel gains 1,000 power for each gold paladin that fights beside him. Uh, no, he's too strong. 23,000 on his own? Silver Fang Witch supports an attack from my vanguard! I don't guard. Checking the twin drive, let's do this thing! Second check. It's a critical trigger. Power to Sagramore. As for the critical effect, Blonde Ezel, Burning Blades! Ha! <sighs> Sagramore! <laughs> Counter Blast, giving him 3,000 power! <sighs> no way. Not even my ninja arts can save me right now. No fair. I have years of experience as a world-renowned card fighter, yet I lost to this kid? There's something more to him, something I couldn't see. <sighs> Well, there's always next time. What a great finish to our first round match! Let's hear it for the group that secured two wins! Team Q4! That's my big brother! Nice! Meow. Oh, yeah! Ninjas, they lost. Of course, Give me a Q break. was the best! Dr. O, did you enjoy that as much as I did? Oh, yes, I always do. <laughs> Your boyfriend won his match. Mm -hmm. Yep. And he might have lost if it wasn't for a special card that someone gave to him. I have no idea what you're talking about. Hmm. Thanks, Paladins. He's back! And he's smiling, you guys! Ha <laughs> ha! Way to go, team! Good job. We did it? <laughs>
My ninjas failed me! Smarten up, man! Team Q4 needs your support! What? Are they playing again already? Team Divination? Divination? Oh, I bet they're all fortune tellers. Like, one is a crystal ball and another has tea leaves and they use them to see far into the future. Where do you learn these things? Guess he's changing sides again. Next time, fortune telling card fight. They use fortune telling to find their winning image. Let's check my horoscope. Dark times ahead? What? Good afternoon and welcome back to the Vanguard Fight Circuit on location in beautiful Singapore. We're nearing the end of the first round, and based on what we've seen so far, I'd say that the VF Circuit is truly a tournament of champions. Only one of these skilled teams can be the big winner here. But they're not just playing for glory, as the top players from this tournament will earn an invitation to another premier event. The stakes are high, and so are the hopes of these talented card fighters. We can look forward to some amazing matches in the second round. No, but like the first round, we'll be keeping the pairings a secret. <laughs> With every passing moment, the competition heats up as we approach the boiling point. Now let's imagine. Let's play Vanguard! Our final match of this round is coming to a close with Team Caesar looking to finish off Team Squall. It shouldn't be much longer. Here I come. Super Dimensional Robo Dayusha! You shall be vanquished in the name of all that is good. Robo Go! Great Sword of Justice! Uh. There it is! Kenji wins for Team Caesar! They end this round with a perfect score! Three wins! Well, Doctor, talented as they are, that was still quite unexpected. Wow, guys, they've gotten stronger. Well, did you expect anything less, bro? They are the former national champions. Yeah, but at the circuit... The teams participating in this event are all at that level, so we can't afford to let our guard down, no matter who we get paired up against. Mm. You've got a point. <sighs> With that, the first round comes to an end, and we can begin to make pairings for our next exciting batch of card fights. But before we move on, let's take a closer look at the team that secured a flawless victory with the least amount of turns taken. Team SIT Genius! Chris! Lee! And Ali! As the name infers, these three are currently enrolled at the prestigious SIT, taking a special program in the field of strategic gaming. Mm. Ladies and gentlemen, memorize these faces, because the new generation of card fighters has arrived. The experts have been saying for weeks that Team SIT Genius are the favorites to win at the VF Circuit. Their overwhelming first round win would certainly hint at the truth of that claim. We look forward to seeing them in action again. Hey! It's a bit early to declare a winner. But time will tell us if SIT Genius has what it takes to claim the top spot at the BF Circuit. Our other teams won't make it easy on them. Mm -hmm. Stay tuned, the second round is coming up. What's the deal? He only introduced one of the teams. I didn't realize that Chris and his friends were that talented. Ha! Who needs those guys? The way he was talking, it's like they're the only team that even matters. I refuse to let those university dorks win. I'll kick their butts back to grade school. It's part of the show, Kamui. I think the organizers are doing everything they can to increase the level of interest in the circuit by giving the crowd a team they can root for. And they wouldn't be doing that unless they were certain that Team SIT Genius had a good chance of being the winner here. Hmm. Yeah, doesn't mean I have to like them, though. I think those great players need to take some classes on being nice to people. Honestly, what kind of person goes to school for card fighting lessons? Cause Vanguard is a feeling. The fear, the joy. Ah, it's a roller coaster! <laughs> right. But you know what? Huh? Their team may be popular, but that doesn't mean they're perfect. Hmm. Mm-hmm. Uh Yeah, totally. We'll win the circuit and do it our way. You got that right. Those geniuses are in for a shock. Okay, we've got a little bit of time before the next round starts. We should go over our decks. Yeah. Aichi, you've grown up so fast.
it's a critical trigger. Power to Sagramore. As for the critical effect, Blonde Ezel, burning attack. The Gold Paladins. I'm finally starting to feel a connection to these cards. I don't have any units with one of those sweet limit break abilities. But... Boosted by Battle Razor, Ashura Kaiser going in for the win! Feely finishing hole! <laughs> but even without limit breaks, my deck is working just fine. I won that first match, and the units I added were solid. I'll stick with the game plan and keep on winning. Oracle Think Tank. I got crushed. I can't blame my deck. I made some mistakes when I was building it. I was considering taking the whole thing apart and building some sort of clan hybrid deck, but the circuit is already underway and that would be too risky. Let's hope the few small changes I made have an impact. All right, Vanguard fans, it's time to get started with the second round. We've already seen some amazing fights, but I'm positive that the best is yet to come. Okay, everybody, it's time to make some noise. This is so oh, exciting. Not again. Huh? If I stay in here, I won't be able to watch any of the card fights. Why didn't I go to the stands? <laughs> but we need your support. Misaki's right. You're like the fourth member of Q4. <laughs> Our first match of the second round features Team Q4 versus Team Divination. Here we have Aichi Sendo versus Crystal. Oh man, would you get a load of these goofballs? Kamui Katsuragi versus Oracle Sticks. What? Do those <laughs> costumes make them better card fighters? Yeah, no kidding. Misaki Tokura versus Horoscope. I seem to remember that in the last shop tournament there was a costumed group of fighters. Overthrow, yo! <laughs> <laughs> The members of Team Divination are all former fortune tellers. They've merged those abilities with card fighting and have become a force to be reckoned with. Huh? No way. Fortune telling is an ancient skill. There's no telling what they can accomplish with those amazing powers. Uh, well... <laughs> Team Q4, sorry to be the bearer of bad news, but you will not win the VF circuit. Huh? I've seen it. Gazing into my crystal ball, I saw the sadness that awaits you. Allow me to predict your future, young man. Mm. Mm. The results have come back. Your entire team will be defeated. <laughs> Want me to read you your horoscope, my darling? Uh. You're into astrology? The stars speak to me, but not today, as the brightest stars are twinkling in your eyes. Twinkling? I find it unfair that they're forcing me to play against someone as beautiful as yourself. What? Oh, the stars have started whispering about what our future holds. Interesting. Apparently, after the battle, you're going to fall deeply in love with me. It's not your fault, my darling. A man such as me is quite simply irresistible. Oh. I can't comment on their fortune-telling, but judging by what we saw earlier, I'd say Team Divination has the skills required to make those predictions come true. What does Mr. Wizard say about the dark arts of divination? Destiny is an opponent no one can vanquish. <sighs> Your team will go no further than this round. I'll let my cards do the talking. Before the action kicks off, we need to take a moment to thank the circuit's major sponsor. Takuno Tatsunagi joins us today from his private booth. I'm gonna win this tournament, because there's no other way I can talk to him. I deserve an explanation about what happened to my royal paladins. Stand up! Schwartz, come 
Join Rimuru as it embarks on a new life journey as a slime on the stage of Vai Schwartz. That time I got reincarnated as a slime. Trial Deck Plus and Booster Pack. Coming soon, Bushy Road. Vai Schwartz, a new challenger appears. Come join us as we band together to fulfill our dreams through our music. Race of Swayland, Trial Deck Plus and Band Dream Volume 2 Booster Pack. Now on sale, Bushy Road. Stand up, Vanguard! Uh, huh? Sweet. I guess it only makes sense that a bunch of fortune tellers would want to use the Oracle Think Tank. That clan predicts the future. The pressure's on Misaki now. Any predictions, Corn? No. <laughs> I'll start us off. Draw! Crystal, what kind of card fighter are you? You'll soon see the future I foretold. Listen, you make my heart beat so hard, same as the beautiful star. <laughs> so, what did you think of my love ballad? There's plenty more where those sweet words came from. But I'm feeling nauseous already. Delving deeper into your horoscope, we discover you're resistant to change. Believe whatever you want, but the two of us are destined to fall in love. Our future together was written by the stars. Maybe the stars can write you a restraining order, creep. <laughs> it's so cute when you get angry like that. Our passion is something you can't deny, baby girl. That's it. This freak needs to pay. He makes my skin crawl. And he's using my deck. I won't lose to another think tank. Hmm. Let me see. The great sticks tell me that you're always picked last for sports in your gym class. Mm -hmm. The sticks can see all, and your physical weakness is just the first mm -hmm. of your secrets that shall be revealed to me. Yeah, right! I'm a track and field runner! You have a terrible immune system and often have to stay home from school. Shows what you know! I'm a pillar of health! And your biggest secret is that you're allergic to fish! I'm a sushi machine! <laughs> My sticks are hitting a little too close to the truth. You need your ears checked! Oh, there it is. I can hear its call. The top card. Can you feel its importance? This card will determine your fate. I draw. <laughs> Thought so. Hmm? Surely you must know what they say. It's bad luck to have a black cat cross your path. That's Dark Cat. Yes, the bringer of bad luck. And from this moment on, a ghostly feline is going to haunt your steps wherever you choose to go. How gullible do you think I am? Let's find out. <coughs> I... I can hear the ghost cat. <laughs> You're affected by the Oracle's curse. No, this can't be. What's that? First the meowing, now an evil wind starts to blow. Why me? <laughs> uh, ah, I won't! I don't believe in ghosts! My turn's over. <laughs> you got me to five. This falls in line perfectly with my prediction. Fate has decided you will not finish me off. <laughs> You're at four damage. You won't be getting another chance to attack. <sighs> Goddess of flower divination, Sakuya, ride! <laughs> Using her skill, the rear guard returns to my hand. <clears throat> this will give me the chance I need to reassemble my battle formation. Your fate is sitting in the palm of my hand. Behold the power of my crystal ball. Call! With Luxford's Soul Blast, I draw. My Sword Dancer gains a thousand power every time I draw a card. Dark Cat! When Dark Cat enters play, my opponent and I both get to draw a card. And thanks to this draw, Sword Dancer just gained another 1,000 power. He may be acting like it's a huge deal, 
But it's highly unlikely that a boost of 2,000 power will be enough to sway the outcome of this game. This guy's totally full of hot air, yo. Oh, really? Calling Meteor Break Wizard and Goddess of the Crescent Moon, Tsukuyomi. With a boost from Luckbird, Sword Dancer attacks! <laughs> Check for a damage trigger. It's hopeless to fight against your fate. Dark Cat lends a boost. Sakuya's coming in! Halo Shield! Mark will guard! You nullified my attack. I thought you'd given up hope. But no. Some people are far too stubborn. Second check! A boost from Goddess of the Crescent Moon. Look out for Meteor Break with his Counter Blast. He gains a big 3,000 power. You honestly think I'm gonna let my teammates down? Guard! Silent Punisher, Weapons Dealer, Gwydion! I was supposed to finish him off. Is my crystal ball telling me lies again? Why aren't you making the future the way I wanted it to be? Uh, where are my great threes? The curse of the black cat is upon me. <laughs> it seems even your deck has turned against you. It's painfully obvious that you're not capable of winning this game. Your friends aren't going to respect you anymore, and the woman you love is going to hate you. She's going to hate me? <laughs> I can't believe what a loser you are. Friendship canceled. We've decided to be part of Morikawa's entourage. I used to love you, but not anymore. <laughs> no way. You're going to be sad and lonely from now on. And it's all thanks to me. You can't. It's not fair. <laughs> That's enough. You hear me? Don't push me around! But what about the curse of the black cat? I'm done listening to your lies! My future is for me to decide! I refuse to lose to you if it means not having Miss Emmy in my life! <sighs> Finally, the sleeping dragon protector of Cray, I leave my destiny in your hands! Arise and show this guy who's boss! The great Kamui rides Beast Deity as a dragon! <laughs> Looks like the bad luck is yours this time. Check it out! Azure Dragon Crushing Flare Punch! <laughs> How did I lose? The sticks lied to me! I'm so disappointed. <laughs> Evil Eye Princess Uriley, then I'm calling a second. <gasps> Bind one. <gasps> Another. Bind it. <sighs> no! I needed those cards for my defense! I'm in some big trouble here! With a boost from Oracle Guardian Gemini, my vanguard attacks! <laughs> I just lost and got my heart broken! The voice of destiny speaks to me. Through my amazing powers of divination, the game will soon be mine. You're overlooking an important detail. Huh? What do you mean by that? You claim to see the future, and yet you couldn't see your downfall right in front of you. Not that! Incandescent Lion, Blonde Ezel. Show him how we roll. Limit Break! <laughs> the Lion's roar calls his allies to battle. Superior Call! Battlefield Tempest Sagramore! Until end of turn, Sagramore's strength is also added to Blonde Ezel. You were able to double your Vanguard's power just like that? There's more. Blonde Ezel gets a thousand power for each gold paladin in the rear guard. Ooh. Call! Knight of Elegant Skills, Gareth! 
He gains strength by having his friends close by. End of the line. I'm gonna finish you off here and seal your fate. Ha! 25,000 on his own? And with a boost from Criff, burning blades! Uh, ha! Uh, I can't guard that. Drive trigger check. Ha! my crystal ball. You haven't beaten me yet. I check for a damage trigger. I lost. In the end, my abilities weren't enough to defeat that limit break. Seems we have a flawless victory for Team Q4. Yeah! Nice! Guys, let's go eat! Hmm? There they are! Team SIT Genius. Oh, look, you guys, it's Team Q4. We heard about you making the third round. <laughs> Nicely done. Hmm, who do you think you are talking to us like that? Come on, you don't. We're the best team in Singapore, and everyone's expecting us to win the circuit. Yeah, there's a lot of pressure on us three to take it all, unlike you guys who just barely scraped your way into the next round. Well, that was a bit harsh. <laughs> it's harsh, but what he said was correct. Uh, you think so? <laughs> <laughs> if we play those guys, we'll crush their hopes of victory! Fortune smellers. I actually like having my fortune told, just not by those guys. Yeah, their predictions were pretty off. We should go to a real one sometime. No, they've converted her! I don't believe it! This tournament is getting intense. Gold Paladins, I know I can count on you. Next time, Dream Girl Dilemma. The only future I care about is the one where Miss Emmy is my girlfriend, and we... Can we get your head back in the game? Stop stepping on my dreams! <laughs> What's with them? They're just... Huh? Uh, I find it best to ignore those two. Oh, sure. Hello! Uh, beautiful weather. Eat up, gang! This big breakfast is gonna help you win your card fights today. Yes, yes coach. coach! Don't you think you're overdoing it, Shin? 
<laughs> Good point. This croissant won't fight my battle for me. <laughs> well, maybe I could tone it down a bit. And Misaki, you could at least call me coach like the other guys. Whatever you say, Shin. Thank you for breakfast. It was our pleasure. Good luck out there. Good morning, everybody. I hope you're ready to see some more incredible Vanguard action. Our competitors must be feeling the pressure going into this third round. It's winner take all. Which of these teams will claim the top prize? Excitement overload. Well, this is it. Let's go in there and give it our best. Yeah. yeah. Have fun waiting. See ya. Huh. I'd forgotten the boredom. The players are locked and loaded for this face-off. Ladies and gents, do we have a treat for you. Our first match of the day features the top card fighters coming out of Japan, Team Q4. <gasps> it's you. They're up against Singapore's Wonder Boys, Team SIT Genius. Team Q4 has shown off some impressive skills, but I wonder if they're up to the challenge of taking on the top ranked team at the VF circuit. Aichi Sendo, we did a little research on you guys after we got back home last night. I didn't know you and your friends were the Japanese national champions. Well, we are. That's quite the accomplishment, but it won't be enough to help you win this tournament. When the dust settles in Singapore, Team SIT Genius will be the only ones left standing. We won't know for sure until we've had the chance to fight it out. I figured you'd say something like that. Now, allow me to demonstrate how strong we really are. Show me what it takes to be a national champion. Misaki Tokura, your decisive victory over Asuka Narumi of Team Asteroid paved the way for your team to claim victory at the Japanese Nationals. But those past accomplishments became inconsequential the moment you walked through that door as the opponent of an SIT genius. I won't lose a single match, Chris. You think you're number one on SIT genius. We'll see about that. Hmm. Lame. We play your team, and I can't even get paired against one of the good ones. They've got me playing against this pipsqueak. What a shame. <laughs> Spare me the short comments! You're barely taller than I am! <laughs> the two of us are so different. Unlike you, I'm well on my way to becoming an adult. <sighs> Check it out. I'm Ali Fazil, one of the best card fighters on Earth, and the guy all the ladies fall in love with. It's so bright! What's the deal here? These sparkles show the hopes and wishes of all the ladies cheering me on. But there's so much of it! Don't play coy with me, Kamui. I'm sure you must have some female fans of your own, right? Yeah, I do have one, and she's the only one that matters. She's perfect. It's like she was pulled straight out of my dreams. <laughs> I've missed you so much! <laughs> Is she a rare and exquisite beauty? That settles it. When I beat you, I'm taking your dream girl, because she'll be happier with me. What a joke! Emmy's my better half! You think I would just let you steal her away from me? <laughs> You're in for a surprise. What? If there's one thing that drives women into a frenzy, it's winning a game of card fight Vanguard. Uh, Face the facts. Uh, when I win, her heart will belong to me and me alone. Say your goodbyes. You lousy joker! I won't sit back and watch while you steal the sunshine of my life! <laughs> so even on the world stage, Kamui's as passionate as ever. <laughs> <sighs> they should stop boasting and get on with the card fight. <laughs> hmm? Hey, sorry I'm late, guys. Actually, you're right on time, Emmy. There's no way I let you steal my sweet Emmy away! Huh? Uh, <laughs> you haven't missed anything! <laughs> Pretty boring, yo. <laughs> Did Kamui just say my name? No, you must be hearing things. That must be it, yo. Why did you turn the TV off? I came here to watch the game, not for your company. <laughs> you with me, Emmy? Mm-hmm. Okay, hold on to your seats, because this matchup is going to blow you away. Six <sighs> talented card fighters, but only three winners. Stand up! My Vanguard! Beast Deity, White Tiger! Schoolyard Prodigy, Locks! 
Godhawk Ichibyoshi, Acorn Master. Crimson Lion Cub Criff, Flask Marmoset. My opponent is a genius, the favorite to win this competition. But even if the odds are bad, I'll still give it everything I've got. Okay, Paladins, it's in your hands now. A national champion. I can't underestimate him. Checking the top five cards. Goddess of the Crescent Moon, Tsukuyomi, Superior Ride. My turn. First I'll ride Thumbtack Fighter, Resinori. Moving Acorn Master. Then I call Silver Wolf. Resinori is coming at ya. Drive trigger check. <laughs> Damage trigger check. Boosted by Silver Wolf, Acorn Master attacks. <laughs> Damage check. I end my turn. Works for me. Draw. Checking the top five of my deck. She's not here. Fine, I've got this. I ride Oracle Guardian Red Eye. Oh no! Once again, she's forced to abandon the evolution of the full moon. Yes, but Red Eye is sturdy and has an ability that should help Misaki out in the long run. Oh, I see. I call. Gaining a boost from Sukuyomi, Red Eye attacks. Drive trigger check. <laughs> Using his skill, since Red Eye's attack was successful, I soul charge. Silent Tom is taking aim. I end my turn. Then I stand and draw. I ride Lamp Camel. I call. Boosted by Silver Wolf, Acorn Master attacks Silent Tom. I want to protect him, but I can't afford to. I don't guard. Camel attacks Red Eye. Lozenge Megas puts a stop to that. Checking for a drive trigger. Hmm? Not a critical. Giving the critical and the power boost to my Geograph Giant. Now with the boost from Pencil Squire Hamskate, Geograph Giant attacks! <laughs> Chocolat will guard. This boy, he's more aggressive than I thought he'd be. I'd better watch myself. New cards featuring popular units are coming to Vanguard. Which unit will you want on your side? Let's card fight with Vanguard now. Don't forget to look out for this. Bushy Road. New cards featuring popular units are coming to Vanguard. Which unit will you want on your side? Let's card fight with Vanguard now. Don't forget to look out for this. Bushy Road. I ride Ringer of Knowledge, Lox. Having Schoolyard Prodigy locks in the soul gives me a bonus. My Vanguard's popularity goes up by a thousand. Stop trying to sound cool! I wasn't done. It also has an ability I can use during this ride. I check the top seven, and if there's a copy of Guardian of Truth locks or a Law Official locks, then I can add it to my hand. A man's only as strong as his clan is. Monoculus Tiger and Pencil Squire to rear guard. Monoculus Tiger attacks announcer shout. Money back guarantee! 
Next up, with a boost from Pencil Squire, Bringer of Knowledge locks. <sighs> I'm not gonna guard. Drive trigger check. I'm Bruce Santa Fe! First two damage on the board. Listen closely. The ladies of the world are crying out for their favorite card fighter. <sighs> Knock it off! You only wish you were that popular! Draw! Riding Beast DD Black Tortoise! Let's go! Brutal Jack! Charging into high gear! Blast that smarty elephant! White Tiger coming in with a boost! Tortoise attacks! Checking the trigger. Then with my Vanguard's ability. Oh yeah, this copy of Azure Dragon going into my hand. Can you hear that? My dream girl's cheering for me back home. Not a sound. At this point, I can't imagine her cheering for anyone but me. You better up your game if you want to hang on to her. With my great nature deck, I'm ready to show you the full power of the wild. Not the full power of the smiles! Huh? <laughs> <laughs> this broadcast is worldwide. The cat's out of the bag, yo! <laughs> Stand and draw. I ride law official locks. When Law Official locks is my vanguard, his popularity goes up by a thousand as long as Bringer of Knowledge is in the soul. Give me a break! Not done. <gasps> I've got a skill to use during this ride. When he enters the battlefield, I choose two of my rearguard units. If they're placed into the drop zone, I get to draw a card. The herd is forming up. Get ready. Here comes the stampede. I call. Boosted by my back row locks, Monoculus Tiger attack. Activating my tiger's ability. See, whenever he attacks an opponent's vanguard, I can choose one of my rear guards and add 4,000 popularity. I'm not gonna guard. I'll have Pencil Squire retire at the end of this turn. <laughs> but before that, he'll lend his support to a crushing attack. I'm not gonna guard. Checking for a drive trigger. Got it! Compass Lion gains a 5,000 point popularity boost and plus one attractiveness to my vanguard. Attractiveness? Damage check? Huh, would you get a load of that? It's a heal trigger. Adding 5,000 power to Tortoise. And I recover one damage. Huh, it seems like your Tortoise is getting a little too popular. In that case, Compass Lion swings in at Jack. Hmm. Yeah, well, Ringo Cora will guard that! We'll survive this one. Now, a couple things I need to take care of as we enter the end phase. Thanks to my tiger's skill, this pencil squire's moving to the drop zone. Squire's counter blast. I search my deck for another copy of pencil squire and add it to my hand. <sighs> I draw a card thanks to the bringer of knowledge. Next up, I'll use Compass Lion's ability. Moving Tiger to the drop zone. And that's another card thanks to my Vanguard skill. Draw. I pass the turn to you. Ali has pulled some seriously slick moves to increase the size of his hand. These stunning combinations will come as no surprise to players of the Great Nature Clan who already know that even the lowliest units can have a big role to play. By the look of it, I'd say he's getting ready to lead this stampede to victory. Now, now, ladies, I'll give you all autographs. It's not easy being the center of attention, yo. That big weasel stole my catchphrase! Mm -hmm. uh... Don't mind him, guys. AG gets a little sensitive about protecting his brand. Kamui the Great will stand and draw! Sleeping Dragon, rise up to heed your master's summons! I ride Beast Deity, Azure Dragon! I call! Jack's revved up and ready! I'll burn through as many of his defenses as I possibly can. I will outlast him! With a boost from Tough Boy, Tortoise attacks! 
Ruler Chameleon will put a stop to that. <sighs> White Tiger lends his support to my Azure Dragon! Okay, just hit me with your best shot. Mm, twin drive check. First. <sighs> damage trigger check. Oh man, a heal? I can't recover any damage, but my Vanguard will take the popularity boost. I'll get rid of Compass Lion! I can guard that with a tank mouse. <sighs> my turn. You must be getting pretty tired of having your butt kicked. My beasts are ready to finish you off. Let's go! Ali Fazil is riding the Guardian of Truth rocks. His popularity goes up by a thousand points as long as I have Law Official in the soul. And with his skill, if either Compass Lion or Law Official leave the battlefield this turn, I'll be adding even more cards to my hand. Then I call. Boosted by Bringer of Knowledge, Binoculus Tiger Attack. I'm activating my tiger skill, adding 4,000 popularity to my compass lion and I'm removing it from play after this turn. Uh, I've got to hold on. Good time for a trigger. Jack can stand back up, but the power goes to Azure Dragon. Then I'll use my Vanguard to smash Jack right here. Guarding that would be a waste. Twin drive check. <laughs> So not only am I more popular than you, but I'm luckier as well. This is the end of the line, Kamui Katsuragi. Supported by Pencil Squire, Compass Lion's coming at ya! You've got to stop him! Our childhood dreams are riding on it, yo! <sighs> I'll nullify it with Twin Blader! Huh. Congratulations. This is the level of a super elite genius card fighter. <laughs> that was so cool. I knew a genius would be the one to win my heart. <laughs> You're the best. No, 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 yeah. she's mine! <laughs> you know, it's pretty sad if you still think you can win this game. Back off, dude! I'm not gonna give up on my dream, girl! I won't let you take me! <laughs> hey! uh -huh. What are you guys doing? Some of us are watching this. Over in the match between Misaki and Lee, we're tied at two damage apiece. Poor girl only has two cards in her hand right now. Not exactly where you want to be with the Oracle Think Tank. I need to rebuild my hand or I'm finished. I ride CEO Amaterasu. Using Amaterasu's skill, Soul Charge. That makes five in the soul. To the bottom. Call. I'm using Dark Cat's skill. Then I'll be drawing a card as well. I call Amaterasu. With a boost from Goddess of the Crescent Moon, I'm sending my vanguard in against yours. I don't need to guard. Drive trigger check. Draw trigger. My rear guard Amaterasu will take the power. I draw. I pushed him to three damage and increased the size of my hand, but I'm not safe yet. I can't afford to hit him again. That would give him access to limit breaks. In that case... With a boost from Dark Cat, Amaterasu attacks your Geograph Giant. <laughs> your turn. Well played. Sensing that I might be capable of unleashing a limit break with my next ride, she kept me at three damage. Q4 didn't make it here by chance. But I won't let her get in my way. Not when I still have so far to go. Lee, it really puts my mind at ease to have a talented player like you on my team. We're going places, and I know you'll be there behind me every step of the way. <sighs> I don't even care about the VF circuit. I just want to beat Chris. I refuse to spend the rest of my life standing in that guy's shadow. I draw. 
the armed instructor Bison. Ride, I call Thumbjack Fighter. Listen up, Misaki. You really wanted to keep me at three damage, huh? Well, I've got bad news for you. Huh? I call Explosion Scientist Boonta. This skill is gonna blow you away. Counter Blast. <laughs> Boonta damaged me. Limit Break online. <sighs> Think I'll walk behind you forever, Chris? I'll show you all. Lee Shenlong is destined for greatness. Team Q4 versus Team SIT Genius. These games are so close, there's no way we can call a winner. Who will Lady Luck smile upon? Only time will tell. Kamui say my name on TV. Uh, I didn't hear anything. What an imagination. Oh no, he's in trouble. Don't worry, Emmy. Kamui the Great will never lose a card fight with his dream girl watching. Dream girl? Ah, too much information. I meant to say green pearls. Wow, Team SIT genius. They really mean business. Next time, pride of the elite. I can hear it in the distance. What's that? It's overwhelming.